Hi dear, so today let's do this grandpa and uh, granddaughter picture. Okay, so just take your paper, keep it in portrait mode and let's start with drawing a big circle in the exact center of your paper. Right below that, we will add a V shape like this way for his collar of the dress. Like this is the neck part and we will add two collars and all. So just right from the tip of that V shape, make one straight line till the edge of your paper or the border. Then let's add two slanting curvy line from either side for his shoulders. Now we will add two big curvy lines for his collar of his shirt. Now we have to draw a curve right in the middle of the circle for drawing his nose and after that on the top of that we will add two more curves like this. This uh, as you have seen in the picture he is wearing a glass a spectacle so for that we have drawn that. Now we have to do that spectacle so I am adding one circle on the right side here and another circle on the left side as well now we have to draw two more lines connecting to the to the edge of that circle okay so now the eye glass is completed now we have to draw two curvy lines right starting from the nose itself because this is uh, and connect it with another curve for the moustache of our grandpa. So we are just adding 2-3 lines this way just for detailings and inside the eye we can just make 2 curvy lines so that he is so happy and laughing and his eyes is closed. Okay. So for the eyebrow make 2 shapes in this way on top of the that I wear that over the glass and two curves on either side for the ears. Now we can add some uh, shape in this way above his ear and you can overlap the head as well this is for some hair on his head because he's a little bit old so all the hairs are gone and only this much hair left so we are drawing only that much only just to show that he's very old okay so our grandpa is done now i'm just adding some detailings the same detailings i have added inside the ears and also the eyebrow so just few lines i have added for detailings so that part is done. Now we can start the head of our granddaughter. So make a big curve on the top of his head and erase whatever comes inside. Slowly erase it and then just continue making her or his head. If it's a granddaughter, you can make uh, the we can distinguish with the hair okay so let's complete the head first so making that oval shape and while drawing the hair okay before that let's add two ears also on either side 
and after that and i feel like the head is little bit small i will correct it later now let's uh, add some hair lines okay so this much is enough if you are drawing a grandson and just add these extras if you are drawing a granddaughter Now adding two eyes and another curve for nose and big curve for mouth. So that's all about the face. Maybe for granddaughter you can add some eyelashes also. You can skip this for the grandson. And from here add two lines like she's waving to the top and two lines like she's holding grandpa. Okay, again I'm telling the head is quite small for me i will be erasing it so now let me focus on the hands okay so adding two more slanting lines then we can add the palm okay just add five fingers in that way no need to be too much detailed and realistic simply like this and the same process we will repeat on the right hand as well Now we have to do the leg of this little girl or the boy so just same process just two slanting lines from either side of his head and connect it with another short line to his shoulder and you can make this kind of curves for the shoes. Now it's like the girl is uh, sitting on the top of his her or his or her grandpa right so you need to make the grandpa holding her so what we will do we will add two hands of the grandpa as well it's quite easy just make a big hand curve like this and few fingers not few fingers five fingers and after that connect it back this much is enough so now it looks like a tiny little granddaughter is sitting on the shoulder of grandpa and she's waving she's very happy and the grandpa also very happy so instead of this if you want to make that boy just erase that uh, that ponies we have drawn over her head so grandson will be ready so now we can start outlining and coloring i'm coloring with crayons okay dear so i will outline using a bold marker and after that i will erase it all out and then we'll use a crayon and while coloring you can use peach color for the face and a gray color for the hair and mustache and the eyebrows rest everything you can color according to your will like the background the the shirt the dress of the girl everything okay so let's do it and finish it
right so the grandpa is ready so that's it just make it beautiful and if you like the session give a thumbs up and comment your feedbacks and also for art classes join us a member and that's it take care